Reconnection successful. There we go. We're back. We're back. So hopefully this will load back up again in a moment. That would be nice. Right. Load up to there. Let's take fire here first. A critical, but not enough. Well, that's upsetting. Uh -huh. Right, let's go. Two damage and unknown damage. That's fine. Welcome back, guys. I don't know what happened there with the uh, server side of things, but we're back and it's working again. So, hi, my name's Ersic Hydra and this is a stream and things. Uh, these guys are actually closed the gap quite, quite sort of effectively on me here. That's fine, this guy's dead. Uh, yeah, let's let's get stuck in there. Uh, this guy should be nearly dead up here, so... If I go here... Yeah, I think we'll shoot him and then move out even closer, just to secure the kill. Yeah, there we go. Right, now I might even be able to run away. Okay, not quite run away, but I'll go to here and I'll heal myself. So this should kind of work. Mm -mm. Oh, you got the base game the other day. Sweet. Good stuff, bud. Uh, I'm going to keep that guy there for now. Ah, oh, I didn't think he'd be in line of sight there. He is, though. Damn. I've got a canticle to heal him, but it's... it's uh, Inconvenient, let's say. Right, let's get this servitor to, to go and tank and spank. Right, so I can go to here. No! I did not want to go there. I did not want to go there. That's fine. We've got a big meat shield at least. Oh man, that was a blunder. Okay, so we're going to go... Over to here. Fire with the AoE pistol. Ah, oh, not in range. Okay, we'll use the AoE pistol to kill this guy. Because it needs to be done. Then we're going to use this to kill him. Or at least to do some damage. My servitors will just about survive this round, so that's something. And we will... Right, let's see what these two do. I'm guessing they will just mow down the servitors. Yep, there's one which should have been engaged in melee. Eek, eek, eek. Uh, 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 let's let me just fix the chat for a second. Are you excited to play the game based on the videos? Cool stuff, man. I think it's I think it's an exciting game. I think it's got some cool stuff going for it. Uh, let's figure out what this guy's up to. I think there's definitely since the changes have been made when they first implemented the game, there's been some some pretty exciting new stuff added. In terms of difficulty modification, etc., I, I think that's a very, a very good touch. Okay, this guy's going to get a go, unfortunately, and he's going to shoot my guy. I might as well use his canticle because it's only. Oh no! I goofed there. I goofed there big time. I have to use it on him next turn, which is fine. It's not the end of the world, but he could have been healed up there. He should be able to use his Curatio Claw on himself, so or Curato Claw, so he should be able to heal up next turn anyway. Um, right, let's... At least this guy's overcharged, so that's nice. Right, so if I go to here, shoot that there. Not too shabby. If I go up to here, that might do one damage to him. 
It's not really worth doing though, is it? Because he's going to die anyway next turn, so... Yeah. So actually, I'm just going to go back to here. Get further away. I used a cog to get a cog, but now at least next turn I will be there and ready to receive it when it loads. That's my plan, at least. That's my thinking. This guy's dead. So we do have some slight sort of damage issues right now. Yes, that, that's going to be a bit of a problem. Uh -huh. Right, let's finish this guy first. Nice, we've got a critical as well. Sweet. So if I use my canticle, that heals him for five. And then we'll use the claw as well. Yeah, there we go. That looks like a good idea. Right. So can I, from here, let's see what information we can get on this. 11. Oh, dear. Okay. This is going to be a bit painful. Eek. I do get to go before them at least, so that's something. One repaired, glorious. Hmm. There we go. Let's have a crit, if we may. I dare be so bold to ask for a crit. And I'll get this guy well out of the way now. There we go. Oh god. I dodged. That's hilarious. That dodge ability, though. Man. That's a real lifesaver. And I've got enough cog to get into melee. So let's find out what this guy's rocking. One. Okay, fine. Uh, I can definitely kill him for free. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll attack the other one. That way when both of them move out of combat, I can kill them for free. Right, so I should get two free kills here. That guy's repairing himself, which is awesome. So I'm not actually going to make it to this console to scan it, which is really unfortunate. Yep, so it's one opportunity attack here, one dead. And then same again next turn. Oh, I only get one opportunity attack. You know what? That has maybe even worked out okay for me. So I can actually shoot this guy. And I can heal myself now. Which means I will end up the match with, well, more hit points. Which means more money. Four? Okay, that saved me 40 blackstone, though. And I'll take the cog as well, because my aim now is to skip go until the next guys go and rush him using a cognition point over towards his console. And that's just saved me another 10. So at least we got the console, we got everything. People are a bit hurt. We've lost all of our servitors. But all in all, it could have gone worse. And this guy should now die. There we go. So that's looking better now. That's looking better. It could have been a, a lot smoother than that, but I think maybe... I'm not sure I'm the best approach for that, honestly. I think that that level, you just kind of feels like you need more mitigation stuff at the ready. Okay, we'll take some of that, and ideally we'll find some places where we can heal our units. Which would be really nice. Let's have a look. Uh, that one. Yes, two, two extra hit points. I'll take it. So two until the exit, or go here. I'm going to be brave. Can't call in extra servitors. Unfortunate. We'll go for this one, because it's more healing. So that's another 20 gained. Although actually gaining Blackstone would be far more beneficial, because you'd gain more than 20. More servitors from Asda confirmed. So it's the only place to get a servitor. 
Right. Ah, we'll take the item. We find find an item while we're here. Ah, an even better claw. Now this takes up a double slot, but it heals for five to seven, which is pretty beast. That is pretty damn amazing. So I'm really happy I've got that. Right, and, and I'll take the extra blackstone from there. And that's the level done. Okay, I don't want to collect too many times. We're done. We're good. Yo, Falcon, how you doing, bud? Oh, let me get comfortable comfortable in my chair. So we're only down to minus 30 overall. Extra armor break on my next attack. Gain three cog points. They're kind of useful to get. We've got a few of these. We've got 500 points now, which is a huge amount. Yeah, our range character is lagging behind a little bit. So after making damage... You lose one HP, which kind of sucks. What I will do for this guy is he's purely ranged, is get this upgrade as well, which is very, very handy and gives him, well, guess what? More range. Kind of says it on the tin. Uh, I'm also going to get one of these because I'm only one step away from getting an armor now. Hit point and energy armor. Seems like a good shout. So, oh no. I basically doubled that like an absolute melon so now he's got a really cool equipment slot though so we can equip more things i can give him an axe that was really dumb of me that was really dumb to to double stack an item without realizing um cog point gained on killing a target we'll gain that for sure Right, so I've got this and this giving me loads of hit points. I'd like some armor on this character, really, but uh, what else can we do? I think swapping his claw for this is probably not a bad idea, so getting a super claw. Why not? Now we can actually heal five to seven, which is a whopping amount. This guy has two spare slots. So, energy attacks gain plus one damage for one round. That's kind of cool, but it costs a cog to use which is i don't know like it sounds okay but it's at the same time it, it's it's totally not okay okay so we got this we got this and we got this i reckon pistols should probably stay the same five hit points we'll take is that the one we've currently got yes it is i can't believe i balls that one up I can't believe I did it. And we'll go for one of these then. So we've got enough. We've got one space. We'll go for an extra curing claw. Why not? Okay, so at least I can cure myself fairly reliably. So we have Deathmark, Flayed One, and Necron Warrior for this. For an extra Tech Priest as well. I think that is probably very worth doing. Ooh, what's this? A Xenorite Macadendrite. Single target melee attack deals damage and acid damage, one damage over three turns. That's not too shabby, actually, for a melee. And this one is a really cool one, so I'm looking forward to getting this, although there is an immortal there as well. There's all sorts of things here. So I'm going to do the easy mission first and get myself an extra tech priest. That looks good. Right. Uh, we'll do this, and perfect. Let's go. Oh, thank you, Jen. I'm back again. I am back. Good to be back. Good to be back. Let me just reload my uh, my YouTube stream, which is not demonstrating you guys chatting. So that's a little weird. There we go. Oh, now I can see you. Now I can see your chat. Necronibus. I'm sorry I missed your messages, but uh, the game was being mechanically lacking. Oh, hi. I'm over here. Fine. Right, let's rock down there. Uh, wrong one. Damn it. I need to stop clicking those so fast. I blame my youthful reflexes. One at a time. That one. That's a good one. Yes. Generally, the two circles, I think, equate to being a good one. I think that's how the developers planned it, at least. 
Right, here we go. I will take Awakening and Cognition. So extra Necrons, great. What could go wrong? What could go wrong? Okay. Uh, extra initiative for them. That's maybe not the best thing to do. Oh, initiative negative for them. That's fine. Let's try again. Fine. Still a few more places to explore. We're getting there. And extra cog. I'd like to increase the bar size. That would definitely help me a lot. And hopefully for the coming battle we have an opportunity where... Ooh, uh, an opportunity where there is one of the largest stacks with three cognition points because we can absorb all of them with one servo skull. Provided I've equipped it, which I'm not actually sure that I have. Yeah. Ah, the foot icon is that I'm faster than the baddies. I thought it was that the enemy was faster. I am a Muppet. Oh, it's this one. Okay, this one's fine. I don't mind this one. Give me my servitors. Bring them to me. Right, I will put you here, you there, and you there. There we go. Charge into Glorious Melee. So you only get one opportunity attack per turn. I need to remember that. Cog at the beginning of the turn, that's very nice. I might go kill this guy straight away. Of course he has physical armor. Why wouldn't he? Right, any larger stacks of cognition points? No, of course not. Why would there be? So I can just about make it over there. And give him a healthy whack. Of course, that's... Not a huge amount of damage, but it'll it'll do. It's better than nothing. Right. One extra attack here. The Skatari gets to attack as well, so I'm hoping that maybe... If I go here... If I do five damage... Nah, that was a bit ambitious, wasn't it? Right. If I do this, though, my servitors <laughs> will take damage and hopefully gain me cognition about how they took damage. No, it doesn't work like that. Never mind. Can't use friendly fire for it. Damn. It was worth a try, wasn't it? I thought that would get me two cognition. Okay. One's down. And I'm going to waddle... Oh, okay. I'm going to go down toward this console so I can get some extra bits and bobs. Right, let's continue. Okay, blue foot's good to know. I am now all about the blue suede shoes for my uh, Mechanicus. Blue suede shoes will make you go faster in the initiative order. That is science. I think it's actually just broken now. We'll give it a second. Oh, okay, it just took a while to load the acid damage. Things were happening behind the scenes, clearly. Whatever happened, though, it's all okay now. Yeah, one more round and he's dead, but not yet. Hmm. I can repair myself, so it's it's fine. Yeah, and I'm I'm going first, so that's all. It's all looking good. Right, put you to there. Good, and 
We'll put this guy down here so we can heal him. Oof. Okay, we'll, sh we'll definitely make sure we kill him by just unloading everything into him. Now at least, now I'm in melee, I, I know I'm going to kill him. Maybe not now, but when he walked away, it, it would be guaranteed. And we'll take the cognition point as well. So we're probably going to need it. And I'll use the repair as well. It only costs one, and it brings me up to maximum, so it's worth doing. Uh, yep, yeah, we'll send this guy in full ham. At least he's going to do what he's set out to do in life. Die gloriously and in melee combat. Okay. Fixed turn. Wow, one damage. Flayed ones are terrible in this. They really are a bit pants. Right. <laughs> It's a cool looking gun that actually. I like the way it shoots. Right, there we go. Okay, now if we go to here, what we'll do is Oh, we got two of these. Fine, okay. We'll repair this one. We will rebuild him. If it keeps him in for another round or two, then I'm, I'm down. Uh, huh. Oh, no way am I out of range. Okay, so if I go to here, presumably I can use this and that will hit both of them. Nope, never mind. That was asking a bit much, wasn't it? Kill the fallen Necron. I will. I will. Oh, no, it gets up in one round. Oh, damn. Thank you for pointing that out. Alas. I am a Muppet. I didn't even realise it. Does it get the go now? It does. Wow. Falcon. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sorry I let you down, bro. Yeah, I didn't realise it was one turn. I thought it was two. I had no idea. Completely oblivious in the turn order. Wasn't looking. I am a noob. I am a noob. Press F. Yeah, press F. Got to press F. I am a I'm a bad, bad person. And an even worse Mechanicus. Where's the death mark anyway? Right. So I don't actually need to shoot him. I can go into melee and I will be able to down him normally. Just by one whack, and then when he goes to move out of combat, I kill him for free. So that's my plan there. I will gather an extra point of cog from down here. Okay, the Omnicide judges me. I would hope so, after my performance. Okay, so I'm going to go here, forcing an opportunity attack from him. Oh, really? He's getting straight back up. That is hilarious. Oh, that is hilarious. Okay, fine. He didn't kill me, though, so it's okay. No harm lost. It got me an extra cognition. Hey, it was intentional. Right. Uh, six to eight damage. No, we'll shoot the Necron here. Damn their reanimation protocols. Yep, that's him in a bit of trouble. Yes, a whole heap of trouble. Fortunately, I've got multiple attacks on quite a few of these guys, so I think we'll be okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll be okay. Right, and I'm gonna kill him straight away. I've learned my lesson, guys. I've learned my lesson. And yeah, I'm gonna heal him. <laughs> Come on, have an extra hit point. Hamana, 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 for the Omnisire. Just keep me alive. Damn, these reanimations are tough going. 
Right, you're dead. And now, where's my last servitor? I think it's this guy to go. Oh, and I crit him too, so that's even better. Warrior, 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 flayed one. Okay, so there's no death mark on this. I don't know why I thought there was. How curious. Well, that's my servitor in the trouble. Makes sense if they reanimated as start of the Necron round instead. Possibly. So... I can basically go here. Oh, I can't even shoot to get... Oh, God damn it. Fine. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't paying attention. Fine. We'll kill him. <laughs> and crit him as well, apparently. Glorious. Okay. Shoot you. And this guy might as well heal himself while he's here. Three damage as well. Nice. Five to seven. Back to full. What a beast this guy is. He's going to be an amazing tank. I can feel it in my bones. Ah, uh, threat level five. Yeah, I think it's because I don't normally get threat level five. Oh, dear. That was so bad of me. I thought it was the servitors. I was like, charge! Get in melee. No, run away from melee because you don't even have a melee weapon. Hydra, you are some type of bad. And I could have even moved away so I wouldn't get shot now. So when this guy dies, it's nothing other than my fault. Right, I will do this. And I will... Do that. There we go. And we'll move away. So is this guy hurt? No. All is well with the world. Right, that will be him dead. And I think I can kill him before it's his turn. Good, good. Bye bye, Servitor. Yo, what's up, Tom? How you doing, bud? Yeah, let the threat get to five. That's uh that's a thing, alright. It's fine though, because we don't have an awakening overall. We turn that off in the settings, which is why I'm being far, far, far more liberal with this sort of stuff. Basically to see how long we can keep a campaign going for. I'm fairly sure, though, on very hard, things will end prematurely. Okay, we're going to delay your turn. Ah, oh, that was a dumb thing to do. He was dead anyway, but that was my own fault for positioning him the way I did. I killed him, and I should feel bad about it. Right, we're finally out of cannon fodder. Okay, he's down. That's nice. Right, I do have the capacity to heal, but I don't have the need to heal, which is cool. Please kill him. No, never mind. Next time. Right, so we're going to... Let's see how much health he's got first, because we've not actually... Oh, joy. Okay. So he'll die when he tries to leave melee, at least. There we go. Give ourselves a full heal. Yep. <laughs> Reanimate, of course. Shouldn't make it into melee... Oh my word, really? Your movement range, my son. 
Okay. I will go to here. Yes, you had an opportunity attack. I'm not very pleased about it either. Okay, now we're going to move away. There we go. There, eh, it was worth it. I got the crit, it's fine. Yeah, go on, I'll heal myself as well. I want to be full health, so... <laughs> oh man, rough. Rough stuff. There we go. Two cogs. One kill. Glorious. And then it's me to go so I can shoot him. Charge the other one in glorious melee. I think I need a cognition point to get there though. It's a long way away. You know what? I'm going to head all the way up here and I'm pretty sure he won't be in range. So... Yep. Okay, we'll do it from a safe distance. I wonder, I wonder how many hit points he has. I've got far superior range though, so there you go, that's, that's fine. Okay, come at me. Oh, it's my other guy to go now. Okay, let's see how much health he has. I probably should have gone to engage him in melee. I've still got enough cog to do it, so I, in fact, think I will. Nice. Nice. Okay, we're good. We're good. I like this. Mission complete. Come on, come on. If you hang around, guys, you may get another peep of the helmet. Giggity. It may happen. Next physical attack will deal plus three damage. It's not too bad. Two attacks ignore armor is fairly good. Six cog, fairly good. Plus five movement for one round is also pretty cool. There's some cool stuff here. So against the Heretics, we're not going to do that one because it's really, 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 really hard. Uh, awesome Blaster to all targets in an area. Fairly good. One additional slot for a deployment in a mission. That is pretty good. I like that. Ah, but first we have uh, Leonardus to upgrade. Right, Leonardus. What are we going to turn you into? I think melee thus far really seems like the most successful of my options. Unless I go for like a huge amount of range. Yeah, these are okay. They're okay. Not amazing, but... Yeah, I'm going to turn him into a range as well. So what do we got here? Energy armor and extra movement. Yeah, we'll go for that. Right. Give this to you. And we've got two slots left for two ranged weapons. So we'll go for a pistol of information. And we'll go for a macro stubber. Okay, this guy doesn't look like he's going to be that useful. Yet, anyway. Yet. So the extra cog I would really, really like. That is a good one. That is a good one. I'm going to do this, and I'm going to hope that things go my way. We're going to re recruit all of you. And I'm going to get... Hmm... These guys are really cool. I like them. 
but I do think the there's some argument for the Vanguard. We'll go for the melee. Okay, hit points, cog points, we can switch to physical armor, we can change that as well. That's not terrible, so we'll go for that. Let's have a bash, see how we do. Must have glorious melee. The next one will be melee, that's for sure. I agree with you, John. Glorious melee is glorious. I've not got enough melee currently, and I do seek to change this. We, we've at least got the uh, the Rust Stalker. Oh, no. I'm fairly sure that just made the enemy faster. I'm clicking too many times. There we go. Just cog, please. Murky buckets. And... Okay, we'll, we'll go here and go for all of the Blackstone and goodies. Oh, what does this one do? Let's find out. All units healed. That's amazing. Thank you. Really, really handy. And this one. All units healed again. The other one was bad. Okay. That's why I didn't go for the other one. Okay. Blackstone. Yes, please. More of that. Good. If you double up on something you've already got, you get more resources, which is always nice. Okay. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. Right. Uh, will I sneakily deploy the Rust Stalker here? I think it's probably good to because it's expensive to deploy. And I'll need to rebuild that cognition. I hate these destroyers, man. They're going twice. Twice in a row. Like, that's not cricket. That's not cricket. Stop it. Uh, I need to delay your turn because your way is currently blocked by a servitor. Right. Oh, they look so cool. They look so cool. Right. Grab that. Around here. Is there any extras? So something's going to come out of there next turn, I think, and I'm going to basically blast it. And up here. Okay, so we're full on cognition. Glorious. Okay, we're good to go. Oh boy! Put that servitor there, because I'm hoping this thing will shoot that instead. Perfect. So now the Rust Stalker isn't going to die in one hit. Which, I, which it might not have, to be fair. Right. Let's go. No idea how much damage I just did. Right, and we're going to do some decent dacker to this now. I think it's got in the region of 20 hit points, so it's going to take a while to hurt it. But I've got enough servitors and other things to, to have a good crack at it. Yep, go there right to the side. Don't want to get too close. Probably should have shot it with the pistol on the way. Would have made sense. And that will do. Get two opportunity attacks now at least. So it should be pretty hurt now. Eek. 
to be fair, it's much better at attacks that than my other unit. And yeah, we're going to rock right the way up to here. Unfortunately, I used my cognition point. Yeah, that's a shame because I wanted to repair this, but... What we'll do is we'll just recharge them. It's, it's kind of worth doing. I think I've actually got the information on it now and it's it's dead. Yeah, it's dead. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. New round. Here comes something. Ah, there it is. I knew it came out of here somewhere. Right. Take that down. Nice. Nice. Okay, uh, oof. I think that's as far as we're gonna get. Okay, let's engage in glorious melee. Okay, good stuff. This is going to hurt my own unit, but, you know, if I can get it to a point where where it's nearly dead, then it's kind of worth. Oh, nice. Even managed to kill it. Ah, oh, that's pretty sweet. Okay. Good stuff. And only one unit is hurt, the Rust Stalker. Aside from that, everyone is healthy. Which is really cool. So we can blow this up, heal the Rust Stalker. The Rust Stalker can go in, save the day. Everything's fine. Can I heal you? Yes! Oh. Uh. Apologies, guys. Just had a weird pop-up. That was me... Uh, one of my videos just popped up. I clicked away a notification on Windows. Goddamn, fresh re fresh install of Windows 10 really messes you up. That's what I've noticed. And don't worry, it will come back in a sec. There we go. Okay, try to get the scan before killing the last, if it's possible. Where is the scan anyway on this? Where is the console? Ah, there it is. You know, I didn't even see that. Yeah, I will definitely try and do that. I see it. More Blackstone, more problems. <laughs> no, I agree. Blackstone is the future. I think one of the other characters might be able to run there, but I'm going to try and do it myself. There we go. We'll see how much we get for this. 88. It makes a difference though, doesn't it? It really does. Okay, Servitor will go front line. Now I should have a decent critical hit chance as well now. Ignores armor too. I didn't even know that was a thing for this, but that's really cool. That's when it's angry machine spirit, but yeah, that's really nice. Okay, let's go there. I don't think we'll crit, but that's a decent damage, though. And I can do this, which will hurt my own units. I'm not going to do it just for the sake of roleplay. Yeah, so I've lost 30 Blackstone there, but, you know, that, that's not really the end of the world. And these guys will take a hit, too, but that's fine. Yeah. 
Yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, let's finish up, move on. We've lost our one cog point. God damn it. Uh, uh. Okay, move out of melee. Does this guy have a healing claw? I really hope so. No, he doesn't. That sucks. So we've got a little bit of micromanagement to do here. Now I'm gonna hurt myself in order. Oh no, never mind. I was going to hurt myself in order to try and get away, but it turns out I didn't have to. I'll tell you what we will do is we'll we'll use this now just to get him healed back up. Not to full, but full enough. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff. Right. Let's rock on down here. Heal up our buddy and see if we can kill the last scarab. There we go. Don't have any cog points though to use one of our weapons, but I it depends actually. It depends which weapons we have. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> exactly. Shoot through this Katari for optimum damage. Okay. Ah, there we go. There's our cog. Everyone's healed up. We're good to go. Yes, there we go. Glorious. We got the black stone. We've got everything. We've got five cognition points in total now, having completed that. We are good to go. It was glorious. Everything is fine. Have I watched TTS? Oh, yes, of course. Emperor's TTS is fantastic. Right, I'm very wary of clicking these too fast now. Okay, we're okay. Whew! We are okay. Right. Restore 10 HP. That's pretty cool. Right, cohort. Leonardus, time to get upgraded. Right, what are you chasing? Damaging servo skull. Mm, that's kind of cool. The extra range for ranged weapons is very handy. So, like, at combining that with a flamer, I think is really cool. But there's some really good other stuff here. So, extra cog at the beginning of a turn. One HP at the beginning of your turn is really good. Next weapon attack reduces cog points. Like, there's some pretty cool stuff here. It's, it's hard to know where to go. Um... I'll probably stick with this for now. I'll probably stick for this for now, just to get him, like, maximum range. Energy. I'm going to go with this for him. Extra energy armor. There we go. He's looking a little bit more sturdy now. I need more weapons, don't I? Really need more weapons. Uh, so this guy can heal himself as well. And I can have this, the, the Enhancer, which is kind of okay. I mean, it makes me deal more energy damage, but I don't have a lot of energy weapons. I'm For now, I'll tell you what, I'll just give him the Curatio Claw. I think that's the most sensible thing to do. Yeah, I, I think that's the most sensible thing to do. 176, so I don't think I can quite upgrade another unit too. Damn, okay. Yep, I actually can't. So, this still seems like a decent one to go for. And Spotlight is amazing. It's got a cooldown of four turns, but it does give you extra armor on your target, which is really, really good if you want to make one guy like your your, your chief priority. 
This though gives me an extra slot for mission deployment and it's marked as easy so I think we'll probably go for that for now. We'll go for the easy mission because I'm a coward. Because I'm an absolute coward. Right. One, two, three. Let's go. We're going to stick with servitors just because they're cheap. And they get me cognition, so, you know, it's all good. Servo skill can be used to wipe down units. Yeah, exactly, Louis. That's kind of like the, the main priority of that servo skull is, as I see it at least, to, to if a unit has one hit point and needs to be downed, definitely amazing. And if it's downed and you need to wipe it, really handy as well because it saves wasting another attack so yeah it's definitely got its definitely got its uses this one was so oh initiative plus increased necron initiative increased but i got a weapon though and it looks like a naughty weapon so we'll see what that is after the match excited about that already uh, Blackstone. Or the Blackstone. Uh, be more sparing with your use of machine speed rig charge weapons. Gives them more powerful buffs. Uh, be more sparing with your use of machine spirit rig charged weapons, do you mean? Yeah, at the same time though, it feels like not attacking with it. Seems like an inefficient thing to do. Because you get like a machine spirit every three turns? Does that give me speed? No, no, it didn't give me anything. I'm not sure, maybe I misunderstood what you said there, Falcon. Uh, we're going to go for this. Extra, oh, healing. Damn it, I thought that was Blackstone. Uh, yeah, go on, we'll, we'll finish here at level three. What's, it? yeah, Blackstone, that's it. That's it, man. Yeah, what's up, Jan? What are you confused with? WTF. WTF, my friend. Uh, load back up. There we go. An immortal as well. And a spider. Or a thingy. Scorpion. Oh, my word. There's so many of them. Uh -huh. There we go. Right. This is going to be interesting. There is loads of them. Eek. Mint machine spirit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't think of a situation where I'd want to not use a machine spirit. Like, by using it sparingly. I'm not sure. I know it gives you a buff, and the buff only lasts for one round. But I'll, I'll, I'll try and think about it. Collect all cog points from one source. A.K.A. three from here. Glorious. Uh, I have to use a cog point to get there. That's okay. That's okay. We're going to see how many hit points it has. Oh, really? Right. I don't think I can kill this in one turn. Ooh. Maybe unless I crit it all over the place. Come on, two damage. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, oh, there's only one to do. Okay, well, so what we'll do is we'll just reveal the stats of the others then. 21 hit points. Damn. And... Use them to kill downed enemies. Ah, right, okay. Okay, yeah, if I use it to kill a downed enemy, then yes, that is... Uh, that is definitely a bit of a blunder, isn't it? Right. So we should be able to kill this unit next turn quite comfortably. Yeah, if I'm using it to kill a downed enemy, then fair enough. That's that's uh, not, not particularly efficient. Oh, one damage. 
handy. Okay, new round. I've got two points to spend. It's probably worth keeping a couple of them, although... Yeah, I'm going to... Just spend one and delay your turn. This one's going to be tough. There are loads coming this way. Right, peep out from here. Do the damage there. <laughs> nice. And now go and hide again. Right, let's go. That's kind of cool. Damage absorbed, though. Unfortunate. I'm thinking I should be able to. Uh, this guy's going to get shot next turn, but I don't want to spend a cognition point getting him out of harm's way. I don't know, Yan. I don't know, bud. Oh, no! Oh, my word. Ouch. Right. Uh, 21 hit points on that's going to be a bit of a problem, isn't it? Two damage. Hell yeah! Okay, it's fine. We can rebuild. We can rebuild. It's not a huge amount of cog to... Oh, really? You're in melee? Okay, fine. I will crush you myself. Ouch. This is rough. I like it, though. I like it, though. Uh... Please kill it. Yes, okay. That's good. That's good. And get you out of there. You kill that. Good. I'm going to use this pillar for line of sight, because I really need to. Okay, this guy's going to take a hit. Yeah, that's going to hurt too. Yep, fortunately I've got enough heals to, to sort all of that out. This map is going to be really rough though. Really rough. And they've got scarabs in there as well. Holy moly. Okay. I'm very nervous. And yeah, I'll shoot this one. Two damage. I'll take the crit. And I'll heal you five to seven. Definitely worth doing that. Definitely worth doing that. Ah, I forgot this guy repairs one of his own accord as well. Plus one damage for the machine spirit here. So I'm going to go for... We'll go for this first. Nice. This guy's so nearly dead. Seems a waste to shoot him with that, so... I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to shoot this. I should probably start targeting the other unit soon as well, but... And... Yeah, let's find out how many hit points he has left. Two. Of course it's two. Uh, I'm going to save Cog. I'm going to save Cog. Stop healing! Damn you! Heal, heal, heal. Tell me about it. 
Ouch. That's fine. I'm totally okay with that. Uh, right. You to here. One to two, one to two. So I might kill this guy. If I'm lucky. Yes. Okay. That's good. And this guy will definitely die. But he might just be downed. If I don't get a crit. Or I could crit and kill him in one. Absolutely epic. Okay. Now one damage I can do. I'm half tempted to, to save this one damage. But I think what I'll do instead is... Scan and reveal what's going on over here. Okay. All is well. All is well. All is fine. Huh. Shoot the scarabs. Yeah, scarabs will be priority. I should be able to... Ah, no, it's it's actually not my... Uh, uh, delay your turn. Delay your turn. I'm happy leaving him there. I'll run out, repair him, and run back again. But yeah, scarabs will be my priority afterwards. But killing those two units for me, that worked out good, which is why I prioritised it. Okay. Nice. And this guy got the cog for killing, which that really couldn't have gone any better. This guy healing each turn, he is an absolute champion. Two to four damage. I can't wait for the scarabs to repair that. Four damage too. Nice. Not too shabby. Uh, I'm going to sacrifice a cog point here. Because instead I get to damage all of these a little bit. Two criticals too. Nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm sacrificing that cog point. It just seemed like a good idea. And... There we go. Only needed those two hit points, so that went okay. We've still got three canticles left as well. They're fine. This guy is going to get healed now, because... He's a champion, and he deserves better. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll go to here. It's fine. I've got my servo skull up next, so... Of course, I can't use my amazing weapon now, but I, honestly, I'm, I'm happy healing him and keeping him alive. Ah, uh, fine. One damage, I'll take it. If I'm lucky. Nope, not lucky though. Let's get out of line of sight. Skip there, skip there, skip there. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. Suddenly things are looking a little bit more reasonable. There we go. The skull means insta kill. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for a skull. I'm not sure which one you're referring to. Is that when I'm hovering over an enemy? Right. If I go here, I can gather all three of these. Nice. I don't think I can go there and get back again, so I'm going to leave him. Right, uh, yep. We'll go for them. And see if... Uh, damn it. We'll go for the scarabs, if we can. They are healers, so if you can kill them, it's always good. Right, oh, we lose a keg cog getting back, but it's it's pretty much worth it. And see what your stats are. All going okay. Yeah, it's not a bad idea, John. 
Try and get a cheeky scan at the end. Critical. Ouch. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm not sure who to send, but is this? Yeah, that's energy, so we want to shoot this guy. It's got two armor, so. And the physical damage, we want to shoot on this guy. Nice. Does anyone need one damage done to them? Go on, I'll reveal statistics for everyone. At least now I know. And the more you know... Okay. I don't think the Mechanicus can actually do... I don't think Servitors can actually do the scan, but... I'll send them anyway. Yeah, there you go. Hero. Oh, more Scarabs. Joy. Scan or destroy. Uh, we're going to delay your turn. Yeah, I don't think he can scan, but I'll send him over anyway. It splits them up, if anything, so that's fine by me. Delay your turn. Right, energy damage on you. A whole one. Glorious. End turn. Oh no, here we go. Here we go. This might actually be a little bit tough to try and uh, break through. Eek. There goes my helmet. Is it still in one piece? Yep, so far so good. Once again. Ugh. It's actually quite heavy. Once again, I'd like to introduce you all to the prop for the coming sessions of Rogue Trader. It's not saying I'm going to wear it all the damn time, but it's an absolutely awesome, uh, awesome helmet. And of course, I am Russell Crowe, so, well, I've got to dress like him. So let's put you back. You stay there. Stay there. Okay. Absolutely dig it. Absolutely dig it. That's, uh, yeah, that's... That's my helmet for jewels. So if I duel in a, in a match, I will wear that helmet. Because reasons. Like, why wouldn't you? Uh, yep. It can't heal two units in a turn, so I'll settle for this. There we go. Looks good. Your juice of poetry. Oh, you're juice so much poetry. And if you edit it, you are in so much trouble. I can't even tell you. He is going to sing. He's going to get out his um, acoustic guitar as well. Play you some tunes. You have no idea. If you don't like his poetry, he'll pin you up against the wall. And denounce you as a heretic. Well, this guy's dead this turn anyway, but... Yep. Oh, wow. Okay, he's okay. He's alive. Scan or destroy? Well, I've chosen. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go here, see if I can get this guy, because three damage will kill him. Ah, it was worth a try. Not particularly efficient damage output from me this round, but otherwise it's kind of going okay. Ah, uh, that's the question, Mr. M Mr. Matt. That is the question. Is he more loyal to the God Emperor, or is he more loyal to his captain? Um, that's... We'll have to wait and see what happens there. Now, unfortunately, that did not do exactly what I wanted to do. What I should have done is shoot this guy with a more powerful hit. 
and then shoot this guy. But this guy's going to resurrect now, so I need to shoot him, which really sucks. I didn't do that one well. I should have shot the big guy with the other... Uh, I don't know. I should have done something different. I'm fairly sure. Uh, right. All done there. It worked out okay, though. We got a kill. This line of sight business is absolutely keeping me in this. Five damage. Nice. Fair play to you. And an extra one. Right. Put him on the platform. It is his task to save us all and scan the machine getting us the valuable cog right delay you eh, I'll go here this guy's only gonna die anyway there we go yeah that is the question I have all sorts of plans for uh, for Professor Crow or Meridius Meridius Maximus Crow that's his full name I have all sorts of plans for him. No, I missed the damage servo skull. I've got it for this round at least. I kind of ballsed that up. I kind of ballsed it up. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to go in and actually chop these guys to death now. Choppy, 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 stab, stab, stab. Uh, I will kill him with a roll of a five if I'm lucky. Okay, so what I'll probably do here is... Oh, no. Please crit. Well, that definitely won't kill him, and that definitely won't kill him. But if I deal one to two damage, then when he runs away, I have a chance of killing him in one hit. So I'll do it. Even if it does mean hurting my own guy, it still seems like the most appropriate thing to do. That's a good point, actually. I probably should have staggered my servo skulls. Right, over here. Nice. This has taken ages, but at the same time... What's going on? Ah, yeah, great. <laughs> Two more just come out of nowhere. Okay. Open fire. I should be able to duck behind this cover here in a second. Right. One damage. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. Hell yeah. And you know what? I'll actually burn a cog point just to not take damage next round. Get the servitors involved. A little bit late, but hey, better late than never. One of them gets to go directly again now, which is very curious. Probably should have killed that guy. That's a maybe a blunder on my part. Uh, you thought a funny name for the gladiator would be Corvus, so I'd make a transition pun. Yeah, yeah, would be fun. Yeah, my uh, he is he is Russell Crowe, so that's that's all I can say for now. He's similar to Russell Crowe, at least not exactly the same there, but there is definitely some overlap. Okay, we'll kill you first. Gather these. Why did I do that there? It wasn't, just really wasn't necessary. So I should only be getting attacked from one of them now. This guy can heal up next turn, so that's that should be fine. Oh, joy. Okay, it's only repaired by two. 
Maybe, just maybe. The combination of one melee and this hit will be enough. Oh, I can't believe I'm not in range. Okay, fine. I'm going in. How much are you going to do? Oh, I don't actually know, do I? Oh, damn it. Okay, well, I've still got the canticle to refresh my cogs. So now's a good time. Even though it wasn't a good time, because I could have done it after just using a cog, giving me an extra one. So basically, I'm still a noob. Nine. Okay, fine. Kill the scarabs first. Right, and you go back in here. Right, Servo's got no chance of getting in range. No chance at all. Right, one opportunity attack. Will it be enough? Yes! Oh, go, yes. You are a sexy, sexy Mechanicus. Oh, that was a bit much. Okay. Pass on your turn. Right, that, that guy back there is not going to be contributing anytime soon, so I'm going to go get stuck into Glorious Melee. And I do have enough to heal myself as well, so I, I'm going to go ahead and do that. And this guy should be dying when he leaves Melee. Should be, at least, if I do another four damage. And there's one left up there. That might even kill him, you know. Nope, never mind. Reveal your stats, and we're good to go. So yeah, again, the Mechanicus are, are safe. They're healthy. And we basically whittled them down with nothing other than line of sight saving us. And... Okay, yeah, we can do it with this. Save us using a cog point. Nice. He's getting up in one turn, so now we want to use the skull to kill him. Nearly on Tomb Awakening 6. That's how, like, blasé I've been about this. Thing is, it doesn't do anything now. Which is absolutely fine. Uh, playing a new campaign? Any changes seen? Uh, yeah, I'm playing a new campaign because I basically died in the last one when I was fighting against the Mechanicus. They wrecked me. So, here I am in a freshen. And it's going okay-ish. We've got three, three Mechanicus so far. And they're semi-healthy. Real emphasis on semi. I'm going to allow him to move out toward me first. Right, and... Ah, there we go. I can get in range, just about. And I might be able ooh, to blow him to pieces. That might do one damage. Beer. Nice. Uh, okay. Yeah, I guess if I put them in front, it's more likely to take the hit, so we'll do that. Okay. Collect those. I might as well charge him in melee now, actually thinking about it. I'm close enough and I will kill him with my physical attacks, so... Yeah, it should, should work. Okay, so do we have... There we go. Next physical attack will deal plus three damage. Does that work to the whole group? Nope, just this one. Six to eight, there we go. Ta-da! Mission accomplished! And hopefully a decent chunk of Blackstone. 
Uh, the Awakening doesn't do anything because of the advanced option I've selected, which is that the Awakening level doesn't exist. So that's basically what I've selected for my campaign, is that there is no Awakening. So that 100% bar, nothing happens. There's just no Awakening level. So I can basically just keep playing and playing and playing and playing and... Well, that that's my plan, at least. Okay, got a new sector. That's nice. 500 for the cohort. That's pretty beast. Right, so what's the cost of the melee guy to upgrade himself? A little bit more, but I do think it might be worth pursuing some extra stuff for him. Uh, extra movement might be nice and extra hit points, but armor I'm kind of thinking, okay, that's going to be priority for me right now. He's only got one armor, which is not a huge amount. Um, he's still got... Gloves have dodge. Uh, that has loads of health, so I w ideally want to get some armor elsewhere on him. But for now, we can move on from there. See who else needs a little bit of love. Uh... This guy is... He's looking alright. Machine Spirit deals plus two damage. That's pretty cool. I like that. And I can't afford to upgrade him again, which is unfortunate, but there you go. So we have a new weapon as well. Gorse Gamma Pistol. That seems really good. Ignores armor and four to six damage. That is pretty beasty. Um, Machine Spirit makes it destroy energy armor too, so that's a really cool, cool, cool gun. I won't get it until I've unlocked the ability to have a free shot every three rounds, because I think that's going to make it actually kind of... Um, actually kind of viable. Um, let's have a see. Let's have a see. Um, what should we equip him with? I've got too many choices. It's tempting to just give him an axe as well, to be fair. There's not much else of much use here. Having an axe? Yeah, I'll go on, let's just give him an axe for now, to carry around. Mission! Let's go for something a bit more exciting. Ooh! We have choices now. Servitor level 2! Servitor level 2! Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. It's tempting, I know. Okay. This gives me a pretty nice AoE. I'm not doing hard. Hard is hard is not going to work. We're going to go for a normal and we're going to go for this. <gasps> That's much better though. And we get one of these. Okay, fine, we're doing this. That's looking good. Ah, that's pretty cool too. An infiltrator. Two to four damage per target. So it's basically four to six damage. Okay, it does less damage than the Skatari Vanguard. Let's see what else we can do. It's got to be something better here. Ah, that will do. Right, let's... Ah, we have another unit to take as well. Excellent. Let's go. This will probably be the last one for this stream, guys. So let's see how we do. Let's see how we get on. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good about this. And we can see this extra battle we up ahead. I'll probably work around it, in all honesty. So I don't, the rewards I'll get from it won't be that huge. Or I could go in for an extra one right now. <laughs> wow. I didn't want any cognition anyway, you know. It wasn't necessary. Uh -huh. Right, melee. Melee. Ranged. Okay, we got this. I should be out of range with them, so... On damage, so I don't need to use this here. I can use this on, say, you. Figure out what he's rocking. No armor there, that's fine. 
And I could have actually got a cog for it, but there's only one on this map, so... Oh, that's going to hurt my guy, isn't it? Yep. Eight. Okay. Fine. Ah, and I generate a cog at the beginning of my turn. That's pretty funky doodle. I like that. Okay. I'm not going to kill him this this turn. I'm pretty sure of that. But I can engage him in glorious melee. Nice. Ouch. Okay, one each. I'm fine with that. Right. I don't really want to be engaged by them. Oh, yes. The dodging animation. The famous dodging animation of awesomeness. It's hilarious. It's amazing. It's too good for words. Right, and I guess we'll reveal your information. Might as well, 10 hit points as well. That ain't too shabby. Might as well fire there. I've got one extra cog. Gonna put the servitor there, just so he can absorb some hits, really. And that will generate me, guess what, more cog. All about the cogs. And this guy gets to attack for free, which I'll take. So I think I gave him the free axe. Yes, I did. Please get the kill. I believe in you. Uh -huh. I'm actually going to allow him to melee me here. Primarily so I can get out and then shoot this guy. Yeah. And now I'll go and engage again in melee. It, I mean, maybe that wasn't worth it, but to me it seemed like it probably was. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm actually going to just save the servitor. Because it's going to be the target of a number of other attacks, so it seems like a good idea for me. Right, that's the end of that beer. Jingle, jingle. Time for another one. For those of you that are worrying about my health, this is only my second since starting the stream, so it's all okay. And it's a Sunday, so you're not allowed to judge me, okay? It's all a bit of fun. Oh, my poor servitor. He is no more. Okay. So we have one of these. I think what I'll do is assume that this guy's going to die in melee. That guy's going to go next. Yeah, we'll go on. We'll, we'll finish him first. Is that worth it? Probably not. The Immortals are quite a pain in the butt as well. They they need a, a special shout-out. The regenerating one hit point, I, I do quite like, actually. That seems pretty neat. Now, was that worth it? I'm not exactly sure. But we'll find out soon. I'm, I'm hoping I can save him. Oh, yes. Please get the kill. You are amazing. You are glorious. Heal him. Okay. He's up to four now, at least. And... Ah. I kind of derped there. I should have shot this guy before I went into melee. Let's have a go. See what we can do. Nice. <laughs> Concerned I'm not drinking enough. My friend, you are a true Games Workshop fan. 
Any lords killed? No, not yet, my friend. Not yet. I'm working on it. I'm working on it, but not yet. I put it, should have put the servo, servo, servo skull over there, I think. That's fine. I can go and gather this manually. Yeah, go on. Let's kill it. It wouldn't have gone up anyway, but... Okay. I think... Maybe this is okay. Because I'll gather them manually next turn. And when he tries to step out, he'll die. So, all is okay. i still got some servitors. Guys have taken a bit of damage, but, you know, we can, we can work around this. We are going to jump on. Jump on this guy. And murder, murder, stabby, stab him with glorious, glorious toasters. Okay. Have at the foul creature. Yeah, you know what? I can do that. It's going to hurt my guys. It's fine. Ah, the line of sight blocked. Fan dabby dozy. Right, how many hit points do you have? Ugh. And I think it's probably worth repairing myself. I'm assuming there's another combat inside here, but if I can somehow leave this with full hit points, it's probably not a bad thing to do. Nice, take those two for free. I don't need to use those two servitors, so I won't. I'll try and keep them. Okay, and I wonder if we can kill this guy before his turn. Actually, looking at it, it doesn't seem that way. I should have let the other guy get the kill, actually, because he would have generated a point for doing so. So how many hit points are we missing? Four. Will he deal four hit points to me? That is the question. I think what I'm going to do actually is sit here and repair this turn. If I repair that way at least this only this guy is going to get targeted, I think. If I go into melee. So I get a free hit on him at least when he leaves melee, so that's something. Now he's down to like 10 hit points and I'm hoping this... Yeah, that's going to hit a couple, isn't it? God damn it. Oh, such a towel. <laughs> yeah, report me. I full... I completely agree. Right, okay. One weapon in range. What do we got? Just kind of hoping for a crit, but never mind. I'm saving my canticles. Seems kind of unnecessary to use them. Uh, Gone, we'll do this. One damage. Yeah. Get wrecked, nerd. Okay. Okay might actually kill him. That would have been nice to use. Five to seven damage. Nice, that's good. We'll take this as well. That's also good. So he's dying when he goes to leave melee. Nothing he could do about it. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Mm. Extra blackstone, I'll take it. Okay, let's finish this mission. I'll try not to just rush to the end, although it's kind of tempting. Ah, cog and blackstone. Okay, decreased. Right, so if it shows an awakening and a Necron initiative symbol... Then, then they go up. If it's just an initiative symbol, then they go down. That seems to be how this works. 
Now, do we fight this or do we just go to the end? I feel like just going to the end is a good bet because this game is hard. Yo, Mac, how's it going? Long time no see, my friend. You busy uh, reporting on the Guardian's posts? Small world, eh? Small world, eh? I was just browsing the YouTube uh, tinter webs the other day and stumbled across Mac Lee commenting on one of our national newspapers inside a YouTube video. Small world. Right, and... We put one servitor here. Let's go. The maths works the way that initiative works as a net increase. Beats me. Okay, let's go here. It's like when I go on some of the other Games Workshop YouTubers that I do find every now and again... Well, actually, quite a few names are familiar, which is which is cool, the fact that there's like a... In terms of the those that do comments, it, there seems to be quite a... a community of sorts. Obviously, when 12,000 people are watching, I can't say all, that all of them are the same, but there seems to be overlap, at least, when it comes to those that write comments. Right, so you are not going to get in range no matter what you do. Okay, we'll go up to this console, even though it's empty and there's nothing to do. But it makes us look and feel important. We'll gather these two, which is awesome. And pop you just ahead. Okay, stick you over here. And we are going to try and finish one of them at least. A critical hit would be good. Not today. Ah, nice AoE splash. Oh, Horace, that's how it works. That's how it works. It's all about the looks. It's about the optics. Right. Take one cog from over here. We can go and gather that one manually next turn. Not the death mark. It's so annoying. Oh, my word. Ouch. That's fine, though. I'm okay with that. They are really, really annoying. How can you see me? Oh, because it's like shoulder height. Damn that wall. <laughs> that sucks. Damn it. Okay, one servitor down. Okay. Okay, I'm going to put you in glorious melee over here. Watch out for the conclave. Hmm. Uh-oh. Right. We are about to mess them up. My Rust Stalker of Doom. It's got ten hit points too, so it's, it's pretty much a beast. Oh no, I don't want to have to waste that. Okay, that will do a decent summer damage, I, I think at least. Okay, fine, you are tanky. Now I can use one cog to get another cog, but at least I'm then in a position to get one for free at the beginning of next turn. And I will repair myself as well. It seems like a good thing to do, seeing as I'm probably going to take two hits at least. Uh... Right, so if I go here, take this one down. Nice, he gets a cog when he gets a kill, remember, which is really, really handy. And maybe another kill would be nice. Nope, asking a bit much. Fair enough. Fair enough. Who are you going to shoot through the wall this time? Scum. Oh dear, this guy's dead. <laughs> yep. That ain't going to end well. And I think we've got one more servitor we can place, so... 
I'm gonna have to think uh, tactically here. Stop hitting me. You're doing so much damage. Oh, the dodge is amazing. This guy's dodged so much. He's a machine. A dodging machine. There we go. That's amazing. That'll cause this guy to go and overwatch somewhere else. Uh, that does mean if this guy moves, he's going to get hit by something. So that's kind of not quite so convenient. Okay, instead of shooting, I'm going to repair. I might even repair myself twice. Yep, I'm doing it. If I repair four in total... Oh, my word, come on. The RNG is not with me. <gasps> you move through the floor! How dare you? Yep, okay, you've got a battle tech, rogue tech to do. I think this is... The expansion's nice. It gives a little bit of extra variety. It gives you some extra things to do. That's all very well and good, and it's, it's sort of nice to have. It, it does some things right, I would say that. It's... It's a, it's a much better game than, than when it came out. I would definitely go so far as saying that. Because when it came out, it had difficulty and balance issues and a whole bunch of other stuff. Now the balance is much better. The difficulty is actually difficult. A lot of the hype for the game is no longer around, and, and I get that, but... Okay. So I'm going to go here first, see if this one is going to die. Nice. End your turn. Three to five. Okay, I'll kill this one because that seems like if I can get kills wherever possible, there was probably a little bit of an overspill of damage there, but it does seem like it wasn't a bad idea. I'm going to shoot this guy just to try and get rid of his overwatch, knock him off. Even though he'll just phase somewhere else, but I just kind of hope it's... No, okay. God, he's annoying. And I'll do a one damage here to get the kill. Even though the next guy doing it would have got me an extra cognition point. Might have been preferable. Right, let's go. Let's do this first. Four damage, not too bad. Collect these. Nommy, 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 nommy. Yeah, and we'll give this guy a heal. The Rust Stalker is doing some real work for me, so... Yeah, that's fine. It's, it's okay, it's going okay. The Servitors are doing exactly what they should be doing. And we're taking damage, but we have enough healing. I would say if there's one thing you need in this campaign, it's lots and lots of healing. And getting that claw, which heals five to seven, has been a real blessing. A real blessing. Okay, let's see if we can take this guy down. Maybe. Being meat shields. Exactly. Oh no, I don't want to kill them. And this guy's claws are on cooldown. Damn it. Right. There. That will hurt my guy, but you know what? It will hurt him, but I think he's out of line of sight. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it. So where's he going? Oh! Okay. Oh no, if this guy dies. I swear if this guy dies. Eek. 
couple ways to approach it. There's different ways to approach a game, definitely. Definitely, definitely. But at the same time, healing is, like, meta, let's say. There are definitely different things you can do to mitigate damage, but healing is, and I think always will be in this, very, very powerful. Especially as you get less Blackstone, the, the less health people have. You can't resurrect and things like that. Probably don't need as much healing if you have a lot of auto heals and things of that nature mixed in. You can probably sort of work around it. Hmm... Okay. Accept and embrace that. It's fine. This guy's only uh only an expendable anyway. Let's go. Nice. Okay. So now we can run up to here. Nom 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 nom. Heal this guy for two to four, which is hopefully going to be four for the love of the Emperor. You need to start bucking up and pull yourself together. Because that seven health is going to be risky. I don't want to heal ten health on the active unit. Oh my word. You are alive. It says I can move here. Minus 16 cog. <laughs> so, what are we going to do? I can shoot this. Which kills him. Um, I do get an extra cog for killing him though, so I'm actually going to do that. I'm going to run in and join them in glorious melee. do extra HP for him because he's going to need it. Then we're going to do next, we'll deal extra physical damage. And then we'll try and cut down one of them quickly. Okay, hopefully that works. No! Okay. Watching me gameplay. Oh, Crystal. Oh, dear. Well, I'd recommend it. It's a good game, in my view. It's not perfect, but it's good. It's a nice, solid game. It's it's not quite like XCOM, but it's not a million miles from it. They are very different titles, but there's enough of a visual similarity, at least, to sort of bring them into the same uh, conversation with each other. Right. Oh, you know what? That's fine. I'm going to rock down here. And we do have our cognition points that we can still get back. So we're going to do that now as well. Oh, boy. It's so hot in here as well. It's all of this mechanical goodness. I've never really felt the urge to roleplay a Mechanicus when uh, when playing three campaigns, but honestly, it's getting more and more tempting. Nice. Nice. Anything else joining? Okay, cool. Yeah, fine. Dance around if you like. Overwatch. That's going to hurt. Oh, no. Five damage. Come on. He was the best man on my team. To be fair, I, I at least managed to dodge the, uh, the Overwatch for this guy. So it kind of worked out okay. So this guy is going to make full use of all three attacks. Number one. Four damage. Oh, okay. That was pointless to do, but we'll do it anyway, just because it looks good. And then we'll engage him in glorious melee. Nice. So he'll die when he leaves melee now. 
Uh, yep, we'll engage this guy. Of course you have an energy shield. Why wouldn't you? Gather all from there. There we go. Oh. Did Adbot uh, give you... Oh, Nightbots. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, there is a Discord link. Anyone is welcome to join. And if you like watching the streams, you are also welcome to inquire regarding the rank of or the role of stream follower which means whenever i go live i do an at at that role so if you'd like to actually catch these things live and not rely on youtube notifying you about two hours after it started then that would be my suggestion because while some people use twitter i respect the fact that uh, we're all adults and most of us don't like twitter because it's evil it's not that bad but at the same time it's that bad i don't have a lot of love for it but i use it anyway why won't you die there we go right collect there we go because it's evil well <laughs> there you go so what I come away from it feeling most of the time, to be fair. It's one of those things that was like, oh, wow, isn't this a great invention and creation? Look at how much good it can do. And then you've just got a, the majority of people sat there using it being miserable. It's amazing for that. And we need to keep using it because we love being miserable. It's, it's fantastic, really. It's fantastic. Right. Let's continue. Right. Aha! We can get a kill, which gives us an extra cog. And we can charge, which gives us another. And pass on a console on the way through. Right, to the console first. To get the Blackstone and the cog. Wow, this is quite the turn. Quite the shopping trip. The BM is unreal on Twitter, that's for sure. Yeah, it's just... I don't know. It's, it's brought out the worst in humanity, if you ask me. And a lot of cat pictures to compensate, so... Although, maybe Instagram and Facebook have taken over from that. Let's not go down there today. We're here to worship machines right now, not software. So we're here... to oogle at our amazing axes and how... How holy they are. How many unguents have been applied. Ugh. Just actually looked at my health of my squad and I'm hoping they can all heal this round because they're actually a bit, like, they're a bit messed up. Okay. Try again. Really? I'm going to heal all the way up. I, I think I need to. Saves me more Blackstone, so why not? And once I go and scan this machine, I'm fairly sure other stuff will jump out at me. Great. <laughs> Can't wait to be shot. Now, I might as well axe this one, just to be... Not much else I can do. Right, let's shoot this. Because for the for the love of the Omnisai, he's got to nearly be dead. Finally. Ah, there we go. Finally, the Servo Skull gets its use. It gets to collect my cog. And it gets to kill him. All in one round. Or did it not collect it? It didn't collect it. It's, it's a dick. Great. Right, and we're going to go... Next turn, he dies. Has been decided. He's got pretty big range, so that's probably enough if I go back to here. Yep, for it to hit me. Ouch. This guy might actually need to run away if he's not got enough. Aha. Let's see how much we repair first. Not too shabby. 
I'm not in range to actually attack him either. Sad face. I really want to kill him. But I will I will take this guy down first. Okay, one step closer. Oh really? Oh wow. I've still got another console to examine. How many more units are there waiting for me afterward? That's the question. Jar, 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 jar. There's all of these awakening tombs here as well. Which makes me very nervous. Yes! Yes! Okay. Over to here. I might miss that console, but honestly, this has taken so long that I'm fine with that. Victory? No, it's not victory. You know why it's not victory? Because there's more enemies. New round, okay. Okay, we'll go here, collect this. Go here and heal you. This has actually worked out okay. If I have a more hit points as a result of all of this, I, I'm totally okay with that. I guess I'll whack this while I'm here. Feels good to do something at least, you know. Uh, yep, we'll head right the way over here, gather this, see what pops out. Extra 95, nice. So I'm going to end up with way over 500 here. Oh, yeah! Wow, there's loads. <laughs> awesome! Okay, go here. Shoot this. I do not want to have to put up with one of those again. Oh, I don't actually have the opportunity to attack. Fortunately, they don't hit very hard. That's that's going to help. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, so what are we going to do here? Other than... Yeah, go on then. Why not? I think with this guy, we're just gonna, like, sit him here. Yeah, I'm gonna move him here. I wonder if he can go around there to get to this. We'll find out soon enough. Hmm. Because I don't have many cog, this I'm I'm a little worried, but only on how much damage I will take. I, I'm not gonna die, I'm fairly sure of that, but Eek! Stop going for my weakest guy! You douchebags. Um Sure, we'll go for you. Nice. Okay, that's good. And, yeah, we'll kill him. It's not really worth me going to there. I take two opportunity attacks, so... Okay. We're okay. We're okay. Now, what does this do? All cog points from one place. Good, 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 good. Right, this guy, I might as well get him to heal himself. He can't do anything else. I've got the spare cogs, so... 
how well are we going to come out of this? To be fair, I've only got one guy on 10 hit points. Everyone else is kind of okay, so I don't think it's too bad. Fortunately, they just don't hit very hard, so that's that's a real help. Oh, that's such a cool ability. All right, get you out. Yeah, I know it hurts. Ow, three. Ouch. Right. Please heal four. Yes. Now, please heal another four. Nice. Lady Luck is on my side. I'm going to... Well, this will kill the downed one at least, so I'm not going to do it. Ah, we dealt a critical. Sweet. Okay, so we're going to focus the southern one to begin with. They normally have about 10 hit points, so that should be fine. Okay, let's crack on. Any other campaigns you guys would like to see, by the way? I've put a comment up on the old YouTube channel, so let me know. But I'm thinking of doing a regular, like every day to do one hour's worth of campaign from one of the available 40k games that has campaign. The only one I'm not sure on is Total War Warhammer 2 because stuff happens so slowly in it and like a turn order takes so long that I'm not really sure it's as interesting to watch. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's super interesting. Let me know in the comments. But let me know now in the chat. Even better. Uh... Is it worth taking? No, it's not really. Oh, ouch. Battlefleet Gothic Chaos Campaign. Yeah, I'm thinking about it, Zirag, so I might I might even start with an hour of that later. Although I have to unlock it, which I haven't even like I've barely scratched some of the other campaigns, so. Vermintide 2? Yeah, Mac, I will be playing the pants off of that. Vermintide 2 PvP will be most likely my regular streaming game. Very, very excited for that. That will be that will be me for quite some time. Um, ugh. Okay, nice. It's going to do one to two damage here. I like these free axe attacks. These free axe attacks are. are pretty nice it's not actually a bad weapon as well like it does four to six damage it's really not that bad the only thing is the machine spirit doesn't break armor but really i think that's a price that's fine to pay nice and um, we're good a little bit of hit point down overall like we're probably missing 80 in total something like that but we got some spending to do now. Let's see what upgrades we can uh, we can swindle. Oh wow! Uh, let's get an item. Items seem like a really good ah. That's really cool. That's really cool. Yes, we did rush to the end of that, didn't we? The Omnispecs actually—that's a really cool item. Use the AOE pistol on your troop guys. Uh, have an energy shield. Yeah, that's a good point actually, isn't it? 110 Odin total that we missed. I mean, we still got 700, so that's that's pretty crazy. We've got loads. So that's pretty beast. Let's have a look. And we do have... So, we are on 198 to upgrade you. Who's a guy with two shoulders? You. You have been uh, poorly planned, let's say that way. This, this seems cool, actually. So we're going to upgrade to there, just to get that. HP max, HP and fizz armor. Crit chance. This guy is basically going to be a range damage dealer. There we go. Like, that was expensive, but... 
If you ask me, pretty cool, because now he gets a whole bunch more crit. So, now what are we going to do with him? Uh, well, let's see what he can actually use now. Uh, da, 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 da. So it's very tempting to have him using stuff like the Volkite Blaster, which is awesome, but I forgot to buy the ability that makes that cheaper to use, and I really need that to use it. So I'm going to stick with the Gamma Pistol, because I do think the Gamma Pistol is really nice. It's slightly more expensive than the Macro Stubber, two to four but at the same time it i can afford to have one of them in the group i would say at the moment um as an alternative i think we'll do a arc pistol for him and he's still got two points spare doesn't he so i guess oh wow he's he's actually okay so we might as well give him a melee weapon by the looks of it i've upgraded him very poorly Okay, so we're going to give him a better Curatio Claw. We'll get rid of that one. We could give him two really good Curatio Claws, to be fair. That might be a good idea. Although, that's also... The Omnispex is really good, so... We'll go for an Omnispex for him, I think. Right. Where's me other range bro? Range bro here. You're about to get an upgrade. Prepare yourself. No! I'm like five Blackstone shot! Oh, my days. Guys, we're going to have to save this till next time. That green gun is pretty beast. Let's see what else we got here. The extra Serpenta. That seems pretty cool. What have we got here? An arc rifle. Random amount of damage and chain targets. That's pretty nice, though. I've got lots of expensive weapons coming in right now. Lots of expensive stuff. Um, that's pretty cool, actually. The fact it destroys energy armor. That's pretty nice. There's some cool stuff coming in. Oh my god, 50% crit chance. Right, guys, we're going to have to save this. Till next time, though. Hope you've had fun. It's been nice having you all here. We'll upload this on the channel. We'll continue this. I'll probably do the rest of these offline, so you can watch them at a later date. We'll continue this campaign, but of course you're welcome to watch them. Um, and I'll stick myself in to have a little chat with you as we go. Once again... Ugh. Oh my word, it's so awesome. Once again, I will see you on Wednesday with my helmet. And if we get in, into a duel, I will wear this. Uh, but until then, have yourself a great weekend. Take care.